morning. My name is Ralph Friedrichs. I'm an addiction recovery coach and life coach and host of this show, the Take Your Life Back Today radio show. You can see a video version of this if you go to YouTube and go and type in Take Your Life Back Today show. This morning, this early morning, I, I'm asking you all to clear out the clutter. I recently watched a documentary on hoarders, people who are so focused on holding on to their things, they don't throw anything away, and for whom living in clutter and trash has become the norm. It made me wonder how many of us are hoarders in our own mind. We're not letting anything go. The worry about our future, the stress over our finances, the frustration with the boss. We carry guilt because of past mistakes, anger over what didn't work out, bitterness towards someone who did us wrong. We wonder why we can't sleep at night, why we wake up tired, why we're not passionate about our dreams. There's so much clutter in our mind that we can't enjoy life whatsoever. You weren't created to live weighed down by worry, by hurt, by guilt, by frustrations. If you're going to reach your destiny, you have to clear out the gutter, the clutter, I should say. Those things are limited. They're limiting your life. When you go through a disappointment, you can hold on to it and live discouraged. Or you can let go of it and say, God, I know you have something better. I know your plans for me are good. I know you are directing my steps. When a medical report is not good, when the contract doesn't go through, when you're facing a legal situation, you can stress out thinking, what am I going to do? Or you can let, let it go and say, God, I know you're fighting my battles for me. I know what was meant for my harm. You're turning to my advantage. You can clear out the clutter starting this morning. You can get rid of negative things that are stealing your peace, taking your joy, draining your energy. All through the day, there's clutter, noise, drama, stress, worry, guilt, jealousy. That's why the scripture tells us to guard our minds. You have to be proactive if you're going to keep your mind in peace. Quit dwelling on thoughts that tell you everything you're not. Program your mind with what God says about you. You've been wonderfully made by God and are exactly how you're supposed to be. Now, get in agreement with Him. With a quiet confidence, you need to have this video playing in your mind. I'm a masterpiece. I'm one of the kind. I'm talented. I'm equipped and empowered. I'm favored and I have everything I need to fulfill my destiny. When you start dwelling on what God says about you, it will automatically clear out the clutter. Fear can't stay where faith is. Discouragement can't stay where hope is. Stress can't stay where peace is. Guilt can't stay where forgiveness is. Mediocrity can't stay where greatness is. An uncluttered mind is a powerful force. Clear out the clutter this morning. Call me at 844-405 help. Together we can help each other take our lives back. Be good to yourselves. Always be good to each other. And remember, a simple smile to anyone can change their entire day and possibly their life and yours as well. Clear out the clutter in your mind early this morning. May God bless each and every one of you. And remember, don't let all...